What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name's Ryan Atuti, and today we're going to be doing something very different here on the channel. We're going to be going back to 2006 to play Swords and Sandals, a game that I grew up playing when I was a kid, back on, like, all the old Flash websites. And you know what? I'm actually super excited to play this game. I think you guys enjoy it, too. I think a lot of you guys know this game, and I just think it'll be a lot of fun to play through it with you guys. And if you want to see this more of this game, Game and not just a one-off you got to hit that like button subscribe as well as turning on notifications to let me know that you want to see this game now there's lots and lots of swords and sandals I want to play through the game that I played through the most uh, swords and sandals 2 Emperor's Reign so we're gonna go and play the classic series and we're gonna be playing swords and sandals 2 like I said select your game gladiator okay let's do this so release from your chains in a dark cell and thrust in the arena you must fight for your life uh, fame and fortune. Your fate rests in your mighty hands. You take on the greatest arena champion in all Brundor in tournaments run by the evil Emperor Antares himself. Let's do this, everyone. Swords and sandals, mm, that's so nostalgic hearing that. It's been so long since I've played this game. I used to sink countless hours in this game this game is so much fun we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna play let's do this you must create a new gladiator before journeying onward create new gladiator my name shall be the great and powerful pancake man his name is pancake man okay let's see i like let's give him some hair we gotta give him the good old-fashioned 2d hairstyle that seems pretty 2D hairstyle like. Let's see, is there anything? Oh, whoa, that that's that's a lot of hair. That's a that's a big afro he's got going on there. I don't see. Oof, oof, that's a lot of these these guys need some. Oh, what is? Okay, that's a little bit terrifying. I don't know if I feel how I feel about any of these things. I think. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty 2D hairstyle like. We gotta change the color. That's very bright. We need some yellow, yellow hair. All right, I can. We can work with that, I guess. The hair's kind of strange, but that's fine. Does he have, this guy doesn't have a beard. That's a pretty mighty mustache. I think we might have to have a mustache. Well, if he's getting, if he's going to have a mustache, he needs a hairstyle that goes with it. I love it. I love it, guys. That's perfect. I don't want to randomize. Okay. So now we got to figure out what we want to do for our skill points. We could max charisma. There's vitality, defense, attack, agility, strength, stamina. There's so many points. We could put one into everything. I feel like we want to put some into charisma. Charisma, I remember charisma being really good, but I'm not entirely sure. We only have nine skill points, and I don't know what's, like, really good to max. Maybe we, I feel like strength is really good to have, but at the same time, I'm not entirely sure. I feel like, I feel like charisma was good. I'm going to put some points into charisma. Let's, I feel like we want to put some, I feel like maxing charisma was really good, but at the same time, I also think that's probably a really bad idea. Let's put five points into charisma. Defense, we don't need defense. We probably want strength and attack, right? Well, agility means how far you go. So let's get, let's get some strength. Let's get some attack and a little bit of agility and how, lots of charisma. I'm going to try that. Let's see how that goes. I mean, worst case scenario, we'll, we'll make a new character. So let's do this play. Okay. Prologue enslaved pancake man pancake man yes that was your name but it seems an eternity something just happened and it skipped the whole cutscene that's okay I didn't push any buttons but we're gonna just roll with it a door opens and your eyes are blinded by the light dark shapes are pour before you soldiers hey get up you in worm in tones of voice it is time you are herded from your cell into an underground arena with several other prisoners. A massive guard in dark armor approaches. Uh, those who will survive will become gladiator, he says, handing each of you a rusty knife. There is no alternative. You are paired off with another prisoner. And so, in a frenzy of blood and with a stench of fear, your days of a gladiator has become... Fearful Prisoner versus Pancake Man. Let's do this. I think I can just yell at him. I'm pretty sure yelling at him, like, does something, right? Pancake Man defeats Fearful Personnel. See, I can just yell at him. Ah! A gift from the Emperor to start you on your way. You received 2,500 gold, and we leveled up, too. Gladiator. 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 I played this game so much. Wow, it's so much fun. Okay. All right, so charisma has always been really good. I feel like one more point in charisma. Oh, I can't take it back. Oh, that's not good. Okay, 
Now let's stamina. Stamina is important, but I want more attack and more strength. Oh, I remember he gets bigger and bigger the more strength he gets. He gets this guy. You get like huge if we have a ton of it. Do I want anything else? I feel like, can I save? I feel like stamina is also important, but I'd rather have high strength. Because I want to be able to shrek people. I want to be able to have this big, like, two-handed weapon. All right. So that's right. We have the weaponsmith, the magic shop, and the armory. So I feel like we want to go to the weaponsmith first and get a strong weapon. I feel like, so, uh, slicing limbs, dropping fire, they require high strength, high agility, and high strength. So do I want, well, let's see. Let's see. More items. Oh, you can get, you can end up getting, like, a, like a scythe. That's crazy. Weapon level 60. That's crazy. So I could get a an a cleaver, which is four to sixteen hacking damage, but that's pretty expensive. I feel like, let's see, well, what if we get the mace? The mace is the the it's a lot cheaper. What's the max the max weapon? The dual maul, which is that, but we definitely need required strength, which is sixty. That's pretty expensive. I feel like I want some armor though. Like I feel like armor is more important. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. You indecipher nature sense and furious me. Leave now. I cannot bear to look upon you. All right. Well, fine. You just don't like my mustache because it's clearly way better than yours. Uh, let's go to the armory. Uh, what sort of armor are you looking for, lad? All right. Well, can we buy a chest plate? That costs three thousand gold. I can't afford that. Let's buy. What about a helmet? That costs twenty armor, which is twelve hundred. What about gauntlets? Ten armor for three hundred gold. 4% extra shove distance. Not bad. All right. I can get that. What do shoulder guards do? So 4% extra charge distance. I like that. Let's let's buy that. Uh, let's get some boots. What's boots do? Extra movement speed. Let's do that. Okay. Boots are actually really cheap. 12 armor. Okay. Let's buy all. Oh, let's see. We're getting like so much. Oh, six armor for 100 gold. That's definitely worth it. Oh, did I get gauntlets? Okay. I did get gauntlets. Okay. There we go. Ooh, a shield? That's way too expensive. I'm definitely not buying a shield. We're not buying a shield. All right, we're going to back out. Anything else you're offering? Let? No, thank you. All right, I, I don't need a weapon. We're going to go enter the arena. I am Arglax, overlord of the arena. What sort of fight are you after, gladiator? I, can we do the tournament? So the tournament is for gladiators level four and above, so I guess we want to just duel for now. So Verdian Jevons is who I'm after. Okay. He's a, I'm pretty sure I can just yell at him, right? Oh, I, he blocked. I'm going to yell at him again. Oh, I'm going to yell at him one more time. No, I'm going to yell at him for a fourth time. See, there you go. When you yell at him, you just get, like, so much money. That's right. I feel like it's more charisma. Because that's what the yell is. Yell is charisma. So the more charisma you have, you have gained ability. Win the crowd. Allows you to gain more gold from fights by entertaining the crowd. The more charisma you have, the more effective this is. That's right. Because you, if you have, like, super high charisma, that's at least what I remember. Duel. Okay. So if I win the crowd... Okay, win the crowd again. See, the more I do that, the happier the the, the crowd just gets like happier. He's got 124 armor, but if I taunt and it goes through his armor, he just loses HP and I instantly win. Watch this, ready? And I yell at him. <laughs> I knocked him over. That's what you get, you weenie. I'm trying to just make them happy because if I make them happy, they're gonna give me more gold. More gold! Yeah. Okay, taunt. I like. <laughs> This guy must be getting so mad. I'm just like, I'm just, I'm clowning on this guy. I'm literally just clowning on this guy. There we go. They're, they're enthusiastic. Wait, wait, there we go. The enthusiastic taunt. Oh no, it didn't go through his HP. Yell at him again. <laughs> this guy doesn't stand a chance against us. Literally doesn't stand a chance against us. Go ahead. They're wildly entertained. That's me, guys. Wildly entertaining. Keep yelling at him. Ah! I gotta entertain him again. There we go. Can I just yell at him again? See, it does 38 damage. How crazy is that? Look at that. So they're even more entertaining. They're transfixed. I gotta make it like so they're ultimate, like super entertained. There we go. They're fans. Boom. No, he blocked it. There we go. All right, I want him to be. I want him to be um, frantical. Oh, fanatical. I'm sorry. Yeah, I got three thousand gold for winning that because I had ninety-eight percent. More charisma. I feel like if I put two. I feel like if I. <sighs> more charisma. I feel like this is. Oh. 
You are approached by a hooded man carrying an engraved wood, rosewood box. He looks around for a moment before whispering to you, Box of mystery, what lies inside? Hand me some gold, stranger, and you shall see. Who pay the man and open the box for 1,200 gold or decline and walk away. I feel like I gotta know what's inside the box. It's, but it's 1,200 gold. That's so expensive. But I did just win and get up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pay him. You hand over the gold. Opening the box, you find a tome of knowledge entitled Arcane Arts. The man disappears into the gloom and you peer through the tome. After reading for an hour, you realize your magicka has grown by three points. That's actually pretty awesome. I'm definitely, I'm definitely ha happy about that. How much money do I have? I have 3,883 gold pieces. I feel like, do I want to... Let's enter the arena. I say, oh, the tournament's next to level four already. Oh, all right. Well, we should definitely get a weapon then. I don't want, I don't want a sword. Let's get it. Let's get a weapon. We can get this four to 16 and this does four to 12. I feel like I want, I'd rather have this. So I'm going to, I'm going to get that. And so that at least me with that. Let's go to the church. Maybe we can, can we can buy? So, um, we can heals 25%. It costs 5,000 gold. Uh, I don't want to do that. Saving your character? I don't really care. Those of lean purse and misery heart will find no solace here. Well, that's because I'm not buying. I'm not buying a health potion for five thousand. That's that's a rip off. All right, what's this? So deflect missile weapons. Twenty four armor. I feel like I really want that. Charisma discount. See, I get a pretty good discount. All right, so I have some pretty cool stuff. Let's enter the arena. I'm ready to battle in the tournament. So John the Butcher Woolridge is a pillar of the community. Every year, he hosts a tournament for low-level gladiators to gain valuable experience. The winner even gets to take on Woolridge himself for a shot at big prize money. So we have to Pancake Man, Titan, Midas the Deadly, and John the Butcher. Wait, I got a, I got a, I got a problem with this. So John the Butcher is a pillar of the community, and he hosts a tournament for low-level gladiators to gain valuable experience. But only one person comes out of the tournament alive. This is in the tournaments. They're like they're a battle to the death. Okay, win the crowd. That's the thing. These are like it's a battle to the death. So these like get kind of crazy. Yeah, get away from me. Go away. I don't have time for this. I have to. I have to entertain the crowd. I gotta let them know who's boss. You know. Okay. There we go. Fifty-five damage. That was insane. That does so much damage. And it's a 92% effective rate. I feel like that's so good. Like 55 damage, that's crazy. And look, like, look how, like, the, the bar goes up so high. To, like, they're so entertained. I'm gonna get so much money, I'm gonna be rich. And I can just get tons of armor and just constantly yell at people. Honestly, I don't think I should have put anything else. I should have had just charisma. Only charisma. I need nothing else. There we go. We got him! See, we ended up getting 2,000 gold for that. That was crazy. All right, we're going up against Mindless the Deadly. All right. Well, how about... Yo, he's got an enchanted weapon? This guy is insane. This guy's crazy. You want me to... I'll yell at you. Yeah, that's what you get. Get knocked over. Yeah, I fart in your general direction. Okay, that's what you get. Okay? All right. <laughs> I like when I yell at him. He just flies across the map. This guy doesn't stand a chance against us. Yeah, win the crowd. Ah! All right, gotta keep. Yeah! I gotta keep yelling at him. Yeah! Ah! There you go. I needed a more manly yell. See, I'm still just indifferent. I gotta dance some more. The more they're interested now, the more I dance, the happier they get. Yo, he made me angry. You don't. You don't want to see me when I'm angry. I'll yell at you. Oh, we're very close now. Okay, well. Ah! Ah! Oh no. Ah! Oh no, he's blocking everything! Um, I'm gonna get him, hit him with a, a normal attack. Oh, he blocked it. I'm gonna yell at him. There you go, that's what you get. Go, go away from me. What happens if I charge? Okay, well I missed, that's a little awkward. He rested? That's against the rules! He took a nap right in front of me, what a power play! Alright, well, yeah! Yo, why is this guy not... I can't hit him anymore with my taunts. He keeps blocking. He's insane. I need to do damage to him. There we go. 54 damage. Do it again. There we go. One more time. And I'm just going to keep yelling at him until I'm, I yelled at him until he died. I don't know if that's, you know, the main play. See, do I want to put more into charisma? Because I get more points and everything becomes cheaper. And I get more money. I feel like there's no reason to not just max charisma. I feel like it's not gonna work in the late game though. I think I think charisma's gotten me as far as it can. I think it's time we start investing into like strength and attack. So what is agility? Agility is like for ranged weapons, right? 
And stamina. Hmm. I could get more magic too. Let's do. Let's let's put more into our strength because I want to be able to do more damage. All right, we're going up against John the Butcher. Behold, arena champion. All right, John the Butcher. Ah! I like how I just yell at him. All right, I gotta win the crowd. Because, I mean, if I... I feel like since this is a boss battle, if I get a lot of money for this, it's gonna be very beneficial. Okay, well, I'm gonna yell at you. Get away from me, John the Butcher. I'm gonna yell at you again. I'm gonna yell at you a third time. No, he, he's, he's be grown impervious to my shenanigans. Okay, keep going. I wanna... I need to make the crowd... I need to win the crowd over, right? I need them to love me. If I can make the crowd love me, I'll be just perfectly fine. Okay. There we go. Yell at him again. Yell at him a third time. Yell at him a fourth time. Yell at him again. Yell at him again. Yell at him again. I need another one. Another one. Another one. Yo, this is... I like how far... He's so far away now. I got him. How much money did I get for it? Oh. Oh, so it doesn't matter. I got 12,000 gold pieces and on top of that another 26,000. That's amazing. I got and it's only day two. Look at that. It's raining. Oh, that's not good. But I think that's going to end off this video. If you guys enjoyed and you want me to play more of this game, you want me to battle through the arena, upgrade my character, become incredibly powerful, remember to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, as well as turning on notifications. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you guys tomorrow for some more awesome videos. Bye, everybody. Whoa!